Hi, this is Rebecca and Hunter Thomason, and we are here for Family Showdown, also two-player showdown. Yeah, this is our channel that we're putting, going to be putting video reviews and top ten lists and anything doing with board games. Um, we're contributors to the board game Blender. We do a two-player segment for them. We've been doing it for, what, two months now? And we decided to kind of start our own channel to throw weird board game things, top ten lists, family reviews playthroughs, whatever we can, can think about doing, we're going to throw on there. Um, hopefully, um, people will meander over to this channel, and this is kind of an introduction to who we are and why we're doing this. Yes, so we wanted to give you a little bit of like where we stand on board games and give you an idea of how we look at them, so when you go through our reviews, you can understand where we're coming from and get a good idea whether or not this would be a good game for you, as a fit for your group or your family, and see if it's worth something you know it's worth something worth looking into so and we like all kinds of games so we're not a specific you know game type or anything like that we play big strategy games family games party games you know simple little filler games we'll, we play all kinds of games we're what I guess we're calling omni gamers we definitely like omni gamers we, we like everything um, the only thing we don't play very much of would be the heavy war games the closest yeah. thing we have is probably um, like uh, War of the Ring and the Star Trek Fleet Captains those are probably the heaviest mm -hmm. games that we own so we yeah. would tend to go on the lighter side for that but other than that we have played every kind of game right and the reason why we got into this, uh, like I mentioned, we were contributors for the Blender, and um, about six years ago or so, mm -hmm. I got heavy back into board games again. Now, when I was a kid, I played all the big games, Axis and Allies, and Risk, and uh, Shogun, and Hero Quest, and all these big you know games from the 80s and 90s. And then after college, I kind of dropped off the board game scene. I mostly played video games and things like that. And my best friend bought me one of these new strategy games and from then it just exploded for me. See, and I came kind of from the other end of the spectrum. My family wasn't big on board games besides Monopoly and Sorry and Trouble and Uncle Wiggly and all the, the roll and move games. We mostly played cards, games like that, um, So, but we always played them and it was a big family thing. It was a, more a social thing than just about the game. So, but when we started dating, we started to play more board games and um, really got into it. And yeah, just over the last few years, I, w I wouldn't have called myself a board gamer probably until just a few years ago. And it's just a nice um, change. We've changed and played a lot of different games. This has been a totally new adventure for me. Right. And like I said, the purpose of this channel is to kind of... I mean, we're, we're attributed as a dice tower, but we're kind of limited in what we can do there. We can just do, we're just doing a, the Blender segments, and we're, hopefully we're going to start doing reviews. But things like top ten lists and playthroughs and things like that, that's not really our area that we will be doing there. So this gives us a place to kind of put the stuff we do for the dice tower, as well as additional things that we just feel like putting on our channel. Yeah, and then like... Um for me, my preferences, and you'll see those as we go through the lists and things. I, I have a pretty wide range of games that I enjoy personally. Um, worker placement, card games, uh, what do they call it? The the deck building games, the pool building, or what do they call it? Pool? Uh, pool building. It is yeah, pool that's building. That's what it's called. Yeah, yeah. The pool building, worker placement. Those. Um, I like some party games too. Again, um, you'll start to see kind of which ones tend to be the ones that I like more um, and I'll explain why I like the, the game personally too. I mean what, what you tend to prefer worker placement worker to. Worker placement's probably my favorite and after that it's probably just generic hero games like video oh, yeah, culture yeah. and, and things like that. Mm -hmm. um, I like party games but you really have to have the right crowd for that. That one that one's hit and miss with me. Um, so I'm probably a little bit on the heavier side um, but Depends you know, like on my I said, mood. Yeah, I play, I play everything. <laughs> yeah. Um, so I guess that's the introduction. That's who we are. That's what we're going to do. Um, I, the majority of things you're going to see on here are going to be two-player stuff because that's what we mostly play. But we do play in gaming groups occasionally. And the girls will probably do some things too. Yeah, we have two young girls. Caitlin's nine. Nessa's four. They play games like crazy too. They, they inherited our bug. So they're going to do some stuff on here and hopefully for the Dice Tower as well. Oh, do we have a contact? Do we want to put in like a contact? 
I mean, the, the, our channel is a family showdown. You're already here, so I guess you know where we are. Um, I, I guess you can reach us on there. There's places to do discussions and comments. So oh, okay. I check in all the time. So if you he's put the it, tech guy. If you put any comments or anything, <laughs> I'll jump on it and, and answer any questions or any suggestions you might have. So welcome to the channel, and we hope to see you often. Yes.